Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video on the Arrowverse. Today we're going to be talking about something very interesting that has been a rumor going around online, and we need to discuss it in a video, so that's what we're doing today. So if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment, and subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any future DCTV videos later this year. Okay, so as you guys know, the Arrowverse is huge, and in the past they've been known to do their crossovers, but in the past couple of years we haven't really got any crossovers because of the restrictions. However, The Flash recently proved with Season 8 at the start of the season that a crossover is possible and that Armageddon actually turned out to be a real thing is definitely a good sign for the near future. However, with The Flash coming to an end and getting a shortened season, it's unlikely that The Flash is going to get much of a big crossover this season in its final season, so all eyes are peeled on the rest of the Arrowverse shows that still exist, like Superman Lois, Stargirl, and the other shows out there, including Titans, Doom Patrol, things like that, because they were all established in Crisis on Infinite Earths to be part of the Arrowverse, even if they're on different Earths. And so that is kind of what we're going to be talking about today because there has been a rumor going around and it's an interesting rumor. It definitely piqued my attention. It seems like it piqued a lot of people's attentions because Paige, Eric, lots of other YouTubers have made videos on it and I've seen people on Twitter talk about it a lot. So I thought, right, I have to make a video on this and give my opinion on what actually has been said. So the rumor that we're going to be talking about today is coming from an account on Twitter called NerdPolitics3. As of the time that I'm recording the video, I think the account has been taken down. I don't know if it's by Warner Brothers itself, like a DMCA or something, or maybe they just deleted the account because it was getting too much attention and if they're an insider, I guess they could be at risk of being caught because apparently they claim to have inside knowledge into the goings on up in Toronto and they have supposedly been involved in some DC projects in the past. And so the big rumor that has been going around spread by this account is the fact that Stargirl, Titans and Doom Patrol may be having a crossover. Now this has been not announced anywhere official so again you have to take it with a big 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 grain of salt because nothing has been announced. However, according to this account, there is plans right now and they may have shot some of that crossover already because the voice actors for two characters on Doom Patrol have already been called in and they've done their voices for supposedly this crossover, those actors being Matt Bomer and Brendan Fraser, of course, playing their respective characters from Doom Patrol. And so apparently those are the characters that are going to be showing up from Doom Patrol in this Titans episode. Yes, they say it's happening in the Titans episode because it is a Titans set that they are reporting from, along with Cyborg, who apparently is also going to be showing up, but obviously in live action form rather than just the two actors in voiceover with their stunt doubles basically playing the masked characters that they are. Just before we talk about Stargo, I actually need to say there has been some rumors in the past coming from the Titans set that have actually turned out to not be true but that was a completely different source and as far as we know we're going to give this source the benefit of the doubt because apparently they've got some stuff right in the past so for now we're going to go ahead with the presumption that this could be happening now this is no confirmation guys so please don't take it too seriously but in regards to Stargirl apparently Breck Basinger who plays Stargirl which finished actually filming its previous season that is currently airing right now. Hopefully I'll make a couple of videos in the next couple of weeks about it. They actually finished filming their season back in March, so it's been a while since they finished, but apparently she is due up in Toronto to film on the Titan set. And so if she actually does come up to the Titan set, that is going to be confirmation of the crossover. So I would say for now, don't get your hopes up until we get confirmation that Breck shows up in Toronto on the Titan set and then you can figure, oh, they're actually doing a crossover. And like I said before, this is going to be on Titans. This isn't going to be on Stargirl or on Doom Patrol. And I guess this is because 
Titans is filming currently right now and maybe the showrunners want to do a crossover but this is very exciting because this is the first time the DC shows outside of the main Arrowverse are properly crossing over so that being Titans and Doom Patrol and now they're crossing over with a proper Arrowverse show that being Stargirl because it's on the CW although it's also on HBO Max as well I would say it's more of an Arrowverse show than like an HBO Max show because remember they started off on a different network, that being Doom Patrol and Titan, so they've always been a little bit different, a little bit more edgy, you know, they can swear and stuff, and Stargirl can't do that because of the CW and their target audience. So, it's going to be interesting seeing these worlds collide if this does turn out to be true, because they are very different worlds, like I said, and I think it's just a great great opportunity to continue to expand the Arrowverse beyond just the barriers that we know as of right now and we've been waiting for a crossover and I really hope this actually turns out to be true because it's going to be very exciting for fans including myself because it seems we're probably not going to get a big crossover on The Flash this season and it doesn't look like Superman Lois is planning to cross over with any of the shows anytime soon beyond just like John Diggle showing up but it's the John Diggle of their earth and so I feel like right now Stargirl is the beacon of hope in the Arrowverse because the showrunner Jeff Johns he isn't opposed to crossing over and yes they haven't done proper big crossovers yet Jay Garrick did show up that was the biggest thing obviously that was very exciting but with this this is obviously a good step forward I would say for the future of the expanded Arrowverse I guess that's what I would call it because it isn't strictly the Arrowverse because like I said they originated on a different network and they were separate. Also it must be mentioned and I forgot to say this earlier, actually Breck Bassinger who plays Stargirl mentioned in an interview a while ago, I believe just before season 3 was due to come out, when she was doing the press rounds that apparently there was something that she was working on with a certain other show that would be a crossover type situation with her showing up on another show as a cameo. Now we all took this I think at the time as far as I can remember as she was teasing maybe someone else coming over to her show and doing a crossover. So we were like, oh is the Flash showing up, is Superman showing up, is you know all these Arrowverse characters showing up but we didn't think it could be Titans or Doom Patrol but it seems according to this what she was basically referring to could have been her in fact going up onto another show like Titans and doing a cameo and considering she teased that and this rumor is coming out I would say that gives it some sort of validity even if we don't have the ins and outs of what's going on it's definitely a positive sign that this could actually happen and I think that is very very exciting by itself. But in terms of the Titans characters that are showing up, I would presume it's like the whole cast because it is due to be on Titans. So that's why I don't believe any information has been released about what Titans characters will be in the crossover. But in terms of Doom Patrol, obviously you've got like three of the biggest characters that are showing up on Titans. That makes complete sense. As for Stargirl, they're not actually bringing on anyone else, it seems. They're just getting Breck, the main star of the show. Obviously, this is a similar situation to what's happened in the past with, like, say, Grant showing up on Supergirl by himself rather than bringing the whole gang with him. So, yeah, we're not going to be seeing the whole Stargirl gang if this crossover turns out to be true. But it would establish that connection across the multiverse, basically confirming to the characters in the Arrowverse that the multiverse still exists. Because remember, after Crisis on Infinite Earths, People just assumed that the multiverse was gone and everything had merged into Earth Prime, but that's not true because we saw the Titans world, we saw the Doom Patrol world, we saw the Stargirl world, and now we have the Superman Lois world, so that means that the multiverse most definitely exists, and so you have to wonder how are they going to make that crossover happen, or well, someone's definitely going to have to cross across the multiverse into the other person's Earth, and so is it going to be Stargirl? Is it going to be any of the characters from Doom Patrol or is it going to be a character from Titan maybe that summon the characters here? I would guess that maybe it could be Stargirl or it could be Raven. I would say that's my best guess as to the Titans character that could summon someone 
into another realm or dimension because you know she is connected to trigon and other realms by itself so i think that's definitely a good possibility now i don't know the ins and outs like i said before but those would be my guesses for now if you guys have any theories let me know down in the comments below i would be really interested to see your thoughts and opinions on this would you be excited for this crossover is this something that you've been waiting for or are you just happy to see a crossover i think personally I'm just happy to see any crossover, if I'm being completely honest. I don't really mind who it is, and I really like Titans, actually. I've been a fan of it, but I'm a little bit behind. I barely watched any Doom Patrol, and I'm a bit behind on Stargirl, so they aren't the shows that I'm most involved in. But considering that it's an Arrowverse crossover, it's going to motivate me to catch up on those shows and get ready for that crossover, because I love crossovers. That is just my favourite thing. It's awesome in the comics, it's awesome when we've done it in the past in the Arrowverse, and I've been really missing it recently, so that's why Armageddon was so good. But for now, if you did enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment. It would really help out the channel. Also, subscribe and turn on notifications if you're new, so you don't miss any future videos, and you can click on the top right corner of the screen to watch my latest video. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll catch you guys later. Goodbye.